quick gut check. Lo Bosworth shared her personal experience, but of course she's not alone. Listen to the numbers here. 36 million people go to the doctor with GI symptoms each year. How many of you? See, 36 million, according to research published in the journal Gastroenterology Research, also shows that GI issues like irritable bowel syndrome and upset stomach are more common in women. Our next guest is a gastroenterologist, best-selling author of Ask Dr. Nandy, Five Steps to Becoming Your Own Hashtag Health Hero for Longevity, Well-Being, and a Joyful Life, and Emmy Award-winning host of The Dr. Nandy Show. Welcome, Dr. Partha Nandy to the show! <laughs> and only guests to walk out with a pink hose. <laughs> I got a hankering or inkling of what this is, but go ahead and tell We're us. We're going gardening. Tam We're going to gardening. So, Tam Fam, take one, one side of this. this. Let me show you. Okay. Let's walk over there. Walk, keep walking. Yeah, keep walking. So this oh, is about gosh. 25 feet long. Believe it or not, this is all wrapped up in your, in your, in your belly. This is the small and large intestine. This is all, all of our small, yeah. this is the length of the small and large intestines in, in all of our belly, bodies. It's all wrapped up in there. And this is where all the magic So this happens. right now is inside me. Well, not that particular hose, <laughs> but something like it. It's wow. 25 feet long, and that's where all the magic happens. Well, and I'd so say so. The gut health, we're talking about gut health, that's where the magic happens. And so, well, I'll take that from Please. you. Please. And so, take I'll put this <laughs> I <laughs> wash my gut. hands now. All right. Uh, so that's what's happening, and that's all of our small and large intestines. And I know that you have a little surprise for us in addition to that. Exactly. And, uh, but before I get there, oh. I'll tell you, there are trillions of little bugs in there that are also working right now. And we talked, Lo talked about, they're texting each other yeah. right now, you know, doing selfies as we go. <laughs> and you want them to be happy. Right. They're like, like, a, like an orchestra. You want those bugs, trillions of them, that are in there like an orchestra working together. You see them right there. They're all inside right now. The entire TAM fam, those of you who are here watching at home, it's working. When you sleep, when you eat, mm. when you're doing your television show, mm. it's working. Hey, so bugs. <laughs> okay, so they're, but they're good bugs, right? They're good and there's some bad. The yeah. key is that we used to think, right, our brain and our heart, yeah. they were the big dogs. Right. They were making your health and giving your longevity. But now we know emerging research is this, that maybe it's your gut. Now, to me, wow. it's the best time to be a gut doctor because if that gut is making your health, we can change it, and we can change it rapidly. And that's why the research shows that gut health affects your mood, your skin, everything about you. And to your point, we've paid so much attention to the brain, the heart, which obviously, but our guts are now getting the attention. You have a surprise for us. I do. First what? time ever on your show, I've we're never broadcasting seen it. Okay. from my gut. All right. So there's a camera right now in your so, tummy? So, yeah, so not, not right now, but I, before I flew... <laughs> Before I flew to New York City in the D in Detroit, I swallowed a little camera pill. I swallowed it about this big. I swallowed it, went through your my, my esophagus, stomach, yeah. and intestine. Do you want to see some pictures of yeah. it? Yeah. So oh. this is my, my oh, gut my right gosh. here. Oh, my gosh. I don't know what <laughs> Beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Why is... That oh, is... God. That is up in here. That's my duodenum, the first part of my intestine. It's pretty. Come on. I have a pretty intestine, don't I? Very pretty. And that's the jejunum. And so what's beautiful What is a about jejunum? It, it's the part of the intestines right here. So here's the beauty it of furry? it. And why is it furry? Is that normal? It's furry because it's got to take all the stuff that I eat and convert it into energy. So all of our intestines are furry? Not all of it, oh, but okay. this one is you want it to be furry so it can absorb it. Oh, I see. And you see bubbles. Broccoli. You see my broccoli flying by right that's there. That's broccoli? My boys and I love broccoli. It's broccoli right there flying by. And you can see it. But what you can't see... What are see, those bubbles? Is that gas? It's a little bit of gas. They got a little gas. gas. <laughs> it's all my business here. Now it's just, she must have heard my gas. Oh my God. <laughs> I wasn't you get prepared to see for that. Okay. I don't know how I recover. So you this can see that. But what you can see are the microbiome we I talked about. I see you about. so differently now. But okay. go ahead. You know okay. me very well. <laughs> okay. So... Here's what we're talking about. What yeah. we can see is the, is the microbiome. So we showed you in this bowl 
all of the good and bad right. bacteria. So I'll take the lids off here. But here is the, the good bacteria and right. here's the bad bacteria, right? And in your healthy gut, you have more good than bad. You see how the blue right. is more right. than the red? Now I want you to put some pink in there. Okay. Like a whole bunch in a there. A whole bunch. Okay. Whole bunch. Oh, yeah. Now I want you to get your hands all dirty, go in there and feel it. Mmm. <laughs> Both hands. Come on, I don't yeah. be scared. Both I'm hands. I'm not scared. I just grossed out. Let's go in there. Well, after seeing and your so intestines. You see the pink, when you put bad bacteria, you all see how the, the, the oh. blue is being taken out. Yeah. That's what happens oh. when you have those pepperoni pizza with extra pepperoni and hot sauce and the cheeseburger with the fries every Did day. Did you know my That's dinner what... recipes from the last week? No, seriously, I ate pepperoni on Monday. I had a burger on Sunday. Last night I had pasta with beef. I ate a lot of meat. I have this to, I... whole weekend you're gonna have nice salad and all the foods we're gonna talk about. That's right. So now, now, so you have this, you have this bad bugs right yeah. in there. So what can you do? Yes, the theory please. is that you can put better bacteria in there, okay. probiotics and food. So I'll do that. Okay, this I'll is the good bacteria. Back okay. There. Yeah. So if I put that back in there, guess what happens? You get back into balance, and so. Okay, so we're tipping the scales in the favor of good. That's exactly. Right? And, okay. and what I like about that is that you can control that. Now, what about the good bacteria? How can you feed it? You got yeah. trillions of it. You're putting some good bacteria in there. I want to represent how prebiotic. Probiotics. Good, yes, prebiotics, that's the food for the probiotics. Okay. So let me put it in there. If you could do me a favor and sure. mix, mix this with this. Okay, big, got it. Mm -hmm. And so you'll see something dramatic happen. Okay. You guys ready? Yeah. All right. So mix it really, really, get oh. into it. Okay. Get into it. There you go. And do you see how what's happening here? You see how it's getting big and bubbly? Oh, yeah. And that's what happens when you eat prebiotic food. The good bugs proliferate. They get Full so this energetic. is what happens in our tummy when we eat good food. It blows up in a good, good way. Good prebiotic food. Pre that's yeah. the food okay. for the good bugs. Okay. And so that's what happens. That's what you want because then that can help your gut become more healthy. Does this make my tummy pop out? It though? does not. Okay. It, it does not. It makes you slimmer, actually. Oh, okay. So I just said that. Oh, I, I, listen, I, listen I'm, so, I'm scared to look back in this show. This is the most terrifying show. So this is bad... Exactly. What is that bad. part of the body? So that's the that's the colon, and you've got ulcerations oh. and inflammation of the colon, and that's healthy. So what you see here is that this colon has been irritated. When you look under the microscope, yeah. and I'm a geek, so I like that. You look under the microscope, you see something really cool in that picture. What you see is that the cells are leaky or have intestinal permeability. So leaky gut, if y'all have been, ever been on TikTok, it's all over TikTok, it's a big buzzword. So what does leaky gut mean? It means that the cells inside are leaky. Yeah. So imagine between poop and blood is one cell layer thick. And what you want is poop not going into blood, right?